Hello everyone, Alchemagri here. Welcome back to Skyrim Special Edition. Last video, we cleaned out and cleared up the stones of cleansing, and now we're going to learn more about these black books from some guy that knows things. Oh, perfect! I can just hop and skip right into it. These videos that are not like... Oh yeah, Ash Spawn. These things apparently exist. It's because of Red Mountain's explosion, ashes, and I'm guaranteeing probably because of the fucking heart of Lorcan crap. We don't get many visitors. Is there something you need? Uh, yeah, sure. What is this place? Telmithrin. It's the home of Master Neloth. You may have heard of him. He's a famous Telvanni wizard. He lives in the giant mushroom. In Morrowind, the Telvanni grow buildings from special fungus spores. Master Neloth grew one here to be his home. Don't ask me how. Fair point. Are you one of his apprentices? No. Talvis is his apprentice. I'm his steward. I manage the day-to-day -day affairs of Telmithrin. All right, then. Now, let's see. One of these fungal homes happens to be where I'm looking for. All right, load up. Trippy. I like it. You. Excuse me, sir. You again. Didn't I see you in Ravenrock? Maybe. Esoteric knowledge that old Hermaeus Mora has scattered throughout the world? Yes. Is it somehow connected to your search for Mira? Yes. Have you? The actual Arkema Infinium, that's it. I've searched for it myself for many years, without success. It was in a Dwemer well, Vault. You should know better than anyone that Hermaeus Mora is not to be trifled with. But he is subtler than most of the other Daedric princes, as you would expect of the Prince of Knowledge and Fate. You seem to have escaped the fate of many who find themselves ensnared forever by the law of his secrets. Or... Perhaps not. All right, well, I found a black book. I need to find found more. Found one? Yes. And you read it too, didn't you? Don't try to deny it. You've got the look. I can see it now. Dangerous knowledge is still knowledge and therefore useful. Usually turns out to be the most useful in my experience. Very true. I have to find out with how to do it. That is a dangerous path indeed. Hermaeus Mora gives nothing away for free. You may end up like Mirak, of course. Two power mad dragonborn. It could be very interesting. Do you know where I can find another one? Oh, yes. They're not hard to locate once you know how to look for them. I have one here that I've been using to locate more. Oh, you have a black book. Fascinating madness engulfed Solstheim. But my book isn't what you're looking for. I'm quite sure it is unconnected with this Mirak. But I do know where to find a black book that can help you. All right. Yes, I do. I haven't been able to get it, though. But maybe together we can unlock the secrets the Dwemer left behind. It's a Dwemer ruin. Forbidden knowledge was somewhat of a specialty of the dwarves, eh? You don't think they would just leave it alone, do you? True. It seems the ancient Dwemer discovered this book and took it to study. I found their reading room in the ruins of Nachardak. The book is there, but it's sealed in a protective case, which I wasn't able to open. But perhaps the two of us together will be able to get at the book. To Nachardak, then. Follow me. Quite the uh, grand collection you got here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Nope, that's a fall to my death. All right. This guy probably wants help with something, so I'm just ignoring his ass. 
Oh, hey, perfect. I discovered it by accident. Well, the Dwemer did... Could, this Solstheim used to be part of Skyrim, so a Dwemer ruin there would make sense. It's just probably one of their more outsourced and far-reaching ones. Give it a couple hours for him to get here. Well, I waited. Let's do this. It's still a ruin. Not to be trifled with. Aha! I knew it. Fair number of reavers, most likely. This is my first time doing this. Please, I've been killing bums like you for a long time. Idiots. All right. The Dwemer certainly Whoa. knew how to build for the ages. These towers have outlasted their creators by millennia. I'll need to unlock the door for us. Let's get on with it. The Dwemer of Nachardak appear to have been fond of these control pedestals. Luckily, I found a cube to operate it inside on my last visit. How'd you get inside the first time, then? I sealed the door when I left to keep out ignorant meddlers. Now. Oh. Unlock it. The book is just in sight. All right, let's do this. You can see the book right here. So tantalizingly close. But trust me, no magic will open that. I'd have had the book already if it could. Huh. All right. No, we'll have to do this the hard way. If we can restore the steam supply to this room, I'm certain I can open it. As you'll see, yeah. that's easier said than done. This way to the boilers. All right. Follow me. Don't go off ahead, man. It's a Dwemer ruin. I know you've been here before. But clearly there's something down here you can't do alone. Nichardak, the city of a hundred towers. In its day, 
It was the largest of the great Dwemer archives, and perhaps the most advanced. Really? In the old stories, when the Nords came to conquer it, it said that Dwemer submerged the entire city beneath the sea until the invaders gave up. I have my doubts, but the city was a marvel of Dwemer engineering. Now reduced to this. See, most of the lower levels of the city are flooded, but it isn't hopeless. The old Dwemer pumps still seem to work. Watch. I need one of those things. But the pumps only operate when a cube is in the pedestal. Unfortunately, I only have one cube. These four boilers provide steam to the room upstairs. They're shot down, but they still respond to the control cubes. So, if we can find four more cubes, we can turn these boilers back on and restore steam power to the room upstairs. Then I should be able to open the book's protective case. Bring that cube. We'll need it. Yes, here we are. This device shows the location of four more cubes Does in it? this section of the city. It looks like most of the cubes were moved to the lower levels, perhaps to try to control the flooding before the city was abandoned. Interesting. That would suggest that the city must have originally sunk during the first cataclysm of Red Mountain. Interesting. Or that the Dwemer's servitors continued to try to preserve the city after their creator's disappearance. Three of the cubes are through. Seems like a sensible place to start. Okay. Sure. Why the hell not, right? I hope the rest of the cubes are this easy to find. Although no Who's there? There you are! So you can stay to die! It's not gonna be that easy, unless you crouch. Why does no one fucking crouch in this game but me? These must be the great workshops of Nachardak. Even in ruins. In the city's days Just of glory, checking. it was reputed to be able to assemble a complete automaton in a single day. Much of the Dwemer's army at the Battle of Red Mountain must have come from here. Alright, so... Because if I were to release the two cubes I already have... Core. 
Uh, I'm gonna have to activate. I'm gonna have to deactivate one of the cubes. Unless this gets me somewhere. Oh, it's just a door. Okay. So I need one of my cubes. Might want to get out of there, buddy. Huh, it's not as bad underwater as I thought. Thought it'd be way worse. Fortunately, each cube we retrieve shuts down the corresponding pumps, raising the... What I you know that. I noticed. We should be fine. Water can't be that high up. Alright. Let's see where this leads. The water needs to get higher. All right. With the water level this high, we can swim across the collapsed part of the passage and reach the other side. Come on, don't fall behind. Fucking hate puzzles, you know. It's 
still, I mean... <sighs> Never trust Dwemer crap. Yes, that must be the pump activator up there. But how to reach it? We'll need to get all three bridges down in order to reach the pump control. Oh, let's see. There we go. That's it. Don't touch anything else. Quickly now. Is some there you That's that. What? an idea. I'll wait here and retrieve this cube once you find the last one with it. Good luck. I don't like the way you just said that. Just so you know, I can and will kill you if you betray me. I hate these things. the cube. Good, good. Then I'll take this cube and we can be on our way. Watch out. Water's rising even higher with both pumps shut down. That was easier than I expected. I'm glad you were here to do all the hard work. Yeah, thanks. With the cube I retrieved from the pumping pedestal, we should now have five cubes. Exactly what we need. All right. Wrong shout. Thank God we're inside. Anyway, come on. Oh, come on, you stupid bastard. Was I supposed to literally wait for you?
Please tell me you drowned. Come on. Idiot. We legit have to go back in the fucking water. Come on. Here, I picked up this cube for you. Thank you. Shall we get on with it? Yes. Are you here? Good, come on. Still with me? Good, come on. Fucking moron. We have the cubes we need. I thought I the boilers in the Great Hall provide steam. We need a total of five cubes. One to operate the pump in the Great Hall, the other four to activate the boilers. Shall we get on with it? It should now be as simple as using the cubes to turn on the four boilers. That seems to have done it. Good. It took longer than I'd hoped, but at least it's finally done. Look out! Another steam centurion! No. Took care of it. Going to head back upstairs and see if the reading room has steam. So, it should be a simple matter to release the book. Let's hope so. There we go. At last. I hope it was worth it. Please be my guest. You deserve the first look. Besides, it could be very dangerous. These books are known to drive many people insane. Well, it looks like we're ending the video right here. So, thank you so much for watching. Share, subscribe, let me know what you think. Leave comments below. Well, you could have your mind sucked dry by Hermaeus Mora, but that's supposed to be very rare. Thank you, and goodbye.